Yes, and also Max Greenfield from the hit TV series New Girl is here. Yes. Now, she's an Oscar-nominated actress. She's one of the sexiest and sweetest stars in the business. Please welcome Selma Hayek Pinot. <laughs> Disappointed. I want to know emotions. what happens if I pull that zipper. <laughs> I don't know. Your ratings uh, would change. You know, it would be R rated. Uh, the R-rated. ratings would go through the roof. Yeah, we would be R rated. Come on, Salma, <laughs> take one for the team. When I pulled my zipper, nobody noticed. Well, what happens if I? No, nothing. I mean, really, <laughs> really tragic. Tragedy happens. <laughs> Tragedy ensues. Well, Avi, look. I mean, you look amazing. Thank and, you. And um, you, you obviously you're a fashion plate, and you live in Paris. So, do you go to any of the fashion shows? Yes, I get to go every season to all the fashion shows that my husband is in charge of, of the brands. Mm -hmm. ah. So I'm really lucky. And also, it's fun because you know usually husbands are not into fashion, like. They don't yeah. know who they, right. you know, that's something you do with your girlfriends, but actually he's he a lot more knowledgeable than Right, me. so what are some <laughs> of the brands that he's in charge of? Give me like a, a, a label. Okay, uh, Gucci. Okay, so do you ever walk into Gucci and go, I have nothing to wear in here. <laughs> 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 no, actually, there's always something. You there's always something. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. And, and if not, there's other. You know, I'm lucky because he has other ones like. Well, on behalf of all them. women, we congratulate you on your Thank incredible you. fantasy life. Thank you. <laughs> Wonderful. We are proud of you. We are happy for you. And I love the way you're wearing this bracelet. It's Isn't nice. That cool? Yeah. It's I love it. It's this, these girls in Paris are doing these bracelets that only come here. And it's comfortable. You can move and everything. And so you wear it right there on that You wear it right head. there. And then when you wear it long sleeve, you can s still see the bracelet. Come on. This is why she's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of... of, of amazing. Feet. Amazing. You have a daughter, Valentina. Yes. She just turned five. She did. So, you know, she, do you do anything special for her birthday? Uh, well, she did get a hamster. It's a milestone birthday. She got yeah. a hamster, Mr. Max. Mr. Max, you yes. have a lot of animals, though. I do, I you have, like, do. a menagerie know, in your house. I know, I know, and I keep getting them, but she really wanted this hamster, and she got a party. She got a, you know, with a... Was it, like, a theme? A theme? Oh, you, you know, I asked her... Would you like to have a princess? Because every year, you know, she was, oh, I want this one or that one. Would you like, which princess would you like? Like you Kate know? Middleton. Or <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You're giving her good ideas. Uh, you know, I said, which one would you like to come? And she goes, well, are you going to get me, like, one of those girls that pretend to be princesses and dress up and come to the party and they're, like, act like they're princesses, but they're not? Or are you going to get me, like, the actress that does the voices for the princess <laughs> to come from Los Angeles? She actually asked she me She's so smart. I yeah. swear, she's the smartest kid. And I said, <laughs> you're five. You're not supposed to ask me this question. And she goes... Okay, then bring me one of those girls that pretend they're the princess, and I'll, pr I'll pretend like I believe her. Oh. <laughs> Super smart. Super smart. You know, you're so poised always, and you always are so Not together. Always, but I, I, I read that you suffer from stage fright, and I can't believe that. Yes, very, very badly. And Are I, you wow. nervous right now? No, but okay, it's, good. I don't know, it's different here, but I didn't know, because it's not always, like, in camera I'm not, but the first time I did a, a play, it was Aladdin, and I was, um, I was Jasmine, and it was obviously for children, so why would you be so afraid? I didn't know I was going to be so terrified, but when I, it was time for me to come out, you know, some guys were going to carry me in one of those mm -hmm. beds, and I'm, like, at the market, and he sees me. I freaked out and I ran out of the theater. They had to catch me. They're threatening me, you know, the Mexican <laughs> owners. Here. You have to go out there. And I'm like, I can't do it. I can't do it. And they put me like these thugs on the bed and held me down and say, one, two, three, go. And they ran on the stage uh, like this, crying, looking the other way. You know, it was so frightening. Oh my God. Well, it children was so are horrible. Children are terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> that's just that Mommy, simple. the princess is crying before the play. No, I was covering my. 
Uh, we have to take a break, but when we come back, we want to play a game with you. Okay. You know, it, it, we're going to call it 60 Seconds with Salma. We're going to really frighten you. All right, we'll be right back. Still ahead on live, we reveal the top boys of the year. Passion and purpose. Um, we're back with Selma Hayek Pino, and we're going to play a fun game with her entitled 60 Seconds with Selma. Yeah. I don't know why all of our games are 60 seconds long. I mean, I feel like we could do three and a half hours we with could. Selma. <laughs> we I'm could. scared. No. We're just going to ask you, we're going to put 60 seconds okay. on the clock. But um, everybody remember, it's really early, and my brain needs more. No, that even makes it I'll better. Try to be fast. Here's what happens if you don't get these right, I get to keep all of your clothes, shoes, and jewelry. Ready? <laughs> 60 Ready? seconds Go. on the clock. What's your favorite pizza topic? Pepperoni. Wrong. Give me your shoes. <laughs> favorite TV show. Favorite TV show. The, 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 good, the good Wife. Yeah. Best place you've ever traveled. Oh, North Island. I don't even know where that favorite is. Favorite Halloween candy. Oh, those, those, you know, I don't know the name, those corn-looking things that are orange, yeah. Wrong. Give me the bracelet. <laughs> Morning person or night owl? What? Morning person or night owl? Both. Both. <laughs> All right, if on a deserted island, what one item could you not live without? What did he say? If what you're on a item? desert island, desert what, island. what one item could you not live without? Water. <laughs> He's you're the first person I'm right. trying to live on this show. Simple. Regular, you know, like, yes. For me, it would be lip balm, but that's why I would die first. What's your favorite condiment? Oh, cayenne pepper. Oh, my All right. I have one more. I have one, one more, one more no, quick no, no. one. The best actor you've ever kissed. Kevin James. Oh. Yeah. You got all those answers wrong. <laughs> We're going to have to take all oh, of your clothing. Okay. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you, darling. <laughs> all right, when we come back, we'll see some behind the scenes footage of Sama in action in the movie Here Comes the Boom. <laughs> Monday on Live from the new mini series. Here Comes the Boom, where you play the school nurse. That's right. And I only wish. <laughs> I'd have been sick all the time. Did you make a lot of trips to the school nurse? No, because school nurse didn't look like that. <laughs> but you had to learn mixed martial arts as well? No, I didn't, because my, my character doesn't do them. But um, for one scene, when we have a date, we decided to improvise and do something crazy. And uh, so I ended up beating him up. Oh, no kidding. A little bit, yeah. And did those guys on the set, like the real mixed martial okay, artists, teach you? Okay, that's thing, you know. They didn't teach me for that, but one day I was bored. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and there were all these, like, tough guys. And I said, teach me how to do it. Okay, I have pants under my dress, so I don't want you to think I look Oh, my that gosh, look at you. They said, T teach me a couple of moods. And it turns out I was pretty good. I didn't... I, I mean, now, you I look like really strong. It. Like that guy is boss root. Did he have yes. a pad on his leg? No, but kicking? I'm like a mosquito, right? I mean, <laughs> I just got good. Like. But you, you, look, you look good. Like nobody in the street's going to run up on you. I know. He was impressed. I was so excited. Like, I'm a warrior. You know, I can do this. Wow. Maybe I'll do some other movie where I'm not the nurse, but actually... Like the action hero. You could do that though. You've done that before. I, I mean, can absolutely. No, the... I've never played that. I always played like the, se you know, the, the sexy. sexy girl in the yeah, for yeah, so me much too. guy. <laughs> you know. I know that feeling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, we have a clip from the movie. Here comes the boom. In this clip. You are on a date with Kevin James. And that's character. the weird date where I beat him up. Yes. Yeah. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. So I saw one of your fights on the internet. Oh, checking me out. All right. I see where you're going with this. How'd I do? I don't understand. When you are asking me out, you are as stubborn as a badger. And then with this guy, he grabbed your hand and you're like, I give up. I give up in two seconds. You know what? Do me a favor. Stand up. 
Okay, I'm gonna put you in an arm bar. Here, this is a Kimura right here. See, feel this? Now, what would you do if I got you here, huh? What would you do? <laughs> what are you doing? Take it easy. My father told me to strike first and to strike fast and to always be there. All right, all right. What, right, what are you gonna do now, huh? Don't do nothing. You're gonna quit. You're gonna quit. You're gonna quit. Of course, I'm hitting you with a close fist. This is a fight. No, it's not. It's like the weirdest date ever. <laughs> Yeah. You know what's the great thing about this film? You saw it, right? Mm -hmm. I saw it. It's I, as a mother, I have a really hard time finding something that the whole, whole family, family wants true. to watch. I mean, if you have a little one, the teenagers don't want to watch it. This movie is it's good for universe, the guys. Yeah. It's great for the girls. You wouldn't think, but I, you have. It's guaranteed because it's so sentimental and so lovely, and it's about also school and coding programs like music yeah. programs and it makes you cry the film yeah. but at the same time it's good for the teenagers and it's good for the, the little ones too there's some violence but i mean it's it's g-rated it's really funny so everybody get out and check out here comes the boom it's in theaters today salma hayek canal everybody hey. 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 hey thank you so much for coming hey. out thank you very much